What up, y'all? This is your boy Ace here, and welcome to Afternoon's Delight. Wow, 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 man. I know, I know, y'all. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. This heel turn was something else, man. It didn't. I don't think it really shocked too many people, though, because I put up a poll. Let me reveal that poll, the, the, the poll results. I put up a poll on my channel, basically asking you guys, um, let's see here. Hold up. So I did a poll. Ask you guys, did, 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 do you think Lita attacked? Uh, I mean, do you think Trish attacked Lita and she's turning heel tonight? 88% of y'all said hell yes, and only 12% said hell no. 29 likes, thank you guys uh, for voting, man. Huge turnout, huge turnout, man. But uh, you know, I've been I've been trying to practice doing more polls while the show is on too. Um, ever since WrestleMania, I've been getting really getting good turnouts. Um, but We'll, we'll likely still do a lot of our polls in the morning too, so um, don't, definitely don't worry about that. But uh, going back to this though, Trish turning heel was not really a surprise to a lot of people. I think because I heard a lot of people just said Trish did it, Trish did it, Trish did it. So it, it's because this is one of those rumors that have been out there for like a month already. That because uh, I even did a video on it, guys, when I said uh, Trish should join Damage Control. So if you've been on my channel and you've been watching my videos, you already know that Trish is going to be turning heel soon. And they actually did it. Because sometimes, the, the, here's the thing though, they can always cancel those plans and just, and just move on with something else. So you never know, like, even though it is a rumor and it's out there, you never know though. So you still got to kind of like do your, your due diligence. But yeah, man, so what basically happened was... Liv Morgan and Raquel Rodriguez won the tag team titles. Trish actually lost a match for Becky Lynch. And, um, you know, because she was filling in for Alita. And then it looked like the two were kind of, you know, trying to get, trying, trying to pull themselves up. You know, Trish raised her arm and then hugged her. And then Lynch went to leave. And then that's when Stratus hit her from behind, bro. And the fans booed. When Lynch stood up, tried to uh, Trish Stratus put down, um, put her down with a chick kick. Stratus leaned over Lynch and spoke to her before leaving the ring. Now I don't know what she said, but it was definitely something. So next video I'm going to talk about the Byron Saxon interview because she didn't really ever say her motive for why she turned heel. I'm pretty. There's always room for that. Whenever, whenever somebody turns heel. They don't have to say it the same week it happens. Like, we could leave that for next week or the week after. And then we could get to it then. But the thing that I want to know is, is the reason why. Because she has motive, though. I mean, she probably didn't want to be a third wheel. She probably got jealous of them. Or her and if Lita, because a lot of people seem to think that potentially Lita, because I know some of you guys have said it in my, in my, in my, in my community tab. That it's possible that Lita might have turned heel with them, with 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 uh, Trish. We gotta be on the lookout for that. And the whole thing is should be interesting. But for those of y'all that's been watching wrestling for a long time, especially when Trish was a heel twenty years ago, you know how good her character was when she was a heel, bro. Like her character was elite, especially when she was at the top of the food chain, winning titles and stuff like that, bro. This 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 got a chance to be a really good, cause Trish played that character so well, man. It be sort of awkward to see Trish, you know, cause she, you know, she comes back, she's a legend, and you know, she's the typical baby face. It ain't, you know, ain't nothing going on really. But to see Trish come back and be a different version of the of her heel character will be very interesting. A little bit older now. Now she could probably be a little bit vicious, like an old, angry lady, right? Uh, she's not even old, but like, you know, like an older, angry lady or something like that that's pushing all the buttons. I think the best put, position to put her in is, like I said, either joining Damage Control as, as the new leader or, because the timing is perfect, looks like they're going to break up Damage Control by the draft. So the the... the the timing will be perfect if they did that. 
or giving her a new stable with a couple of henchmen or something like that, like a Zoe Stark and somebody else. Bro, they got some things here that they could do. We're going to talk about that in a big video that I'm planning on making later this week um, or by the weekend or something like that because I want to make a big video before Raw next Monday seeing what direction they could go in with Trish because I already made a video. Y'all can watch that one, the one that I made almost a month ago. Talking about her needing to join damage control and all the problems that damage control had, why they didn't work. She could get them over, man. So, um, but uh, it's it's interesting though, man, because I know some people initially did not want to see it, but I think some people are warming up to it now that it's happened and seeing where it's gonna go. It's fun because it, it's Trish. It's like people loved her heel character, so it, it's perfect it being her than somebody else and this is your opportunity to use somebody with a big name like trish stratus and get some wrestlers up under her to her status and then you already got the perfect opponent in becky lynch you don't need nothing else because becky lynch is already over with the fans so you got the perfect person to go against in this feud so i like it man i like it man go, let me know in the uh comment section what y'all think we're going to do the byron saxton video next um backstage so i'll see y'all over there thank y'all for watching oh hit that like button for me share the video subscribe to the channel thank you for watching after news to like